Those big roots are stronger than they look. You can jump on them to get a better position. Don't let a single slime get by. Uh... What... what slimes? What... what slimes, though? I shot them. The big tree up the river. This this tree? I found the nerds. Oh, greetings, nerds. I'm digging this. Oh, there they are. Oh. And there's another friend over there. I'll deal with the nerds last. Oh, they're down the waterfall? I didn't even see them. Slimes. Slime Mida. Take them out before they even land. Choiled Mida. <laughs> well, there's so many. Oh Holy my crap, goodness. There's so many. They were not screwed around. How do these kids get this many balloons, though? Like, seriously. You guys eating lunch? That looks really good. I guess. I don't really like mine. Um, uh, me neither. Maybe we can give it to someone else? But I'm hungry. You should definitely eat something. Nutrition is important. But if you're going to give it away anyway, maybe you can give it to each other? Oh, like a trade? That sounds perfect. Who wants mine? Oops. Um, never fear, folks. The green hero shall solve this lunchtime puzzle. I'll talk to each of you and figure out which lunch would be best for which person. Oh, cool. Thank you. This is so cute. Light and healthy, please. Apple slices. Apple slices sound great. I'd love that. I want a lot of food, please. I'm I'm really hungry. Lasagna. Yummy. I'll eat a, that whole dish. And then you get the chips. I like salty food, but I only want a small snack. Yeah, those look good. I'm stuffed. I feel healthy and strong. I got just what I wanted. Thank you, Green Hero. Happy to help. We should go do something at the playground now. Yeah, good idea. See you there. I'm wondering where she got that pretty crown. Okay, let's go back down the waterfall since apparently that's where they are. Oh, I see. Die, slimes, die. You can't oh. hide. Oh no. Low gator. Victory is ours. Now I have to climb all the way back up. Oh, wait.
The balloons are so cute. That was amazing. You must be the legend, the hero of legend. I am. What gave it away? Oh, Tom told me to look out for a fidgety alligator, and that would be the hero. Um, I mean, it was your skills with the sword, of course. No ordinary soldier could have done that alone. I threw rocks. Hey, <laughs> you. We should celebrate your our victory back at the playground. Dang, her shield must be heavy. It is made of like actual wood. Wait, wait. I wonder if I carry something that big. That's actually just three two by fours strapped together with some plywood. Like, that's actually gotta be heavy. Penelope's parents had some lumber in the garage, dang. Penelope's also a child. Are you talking to a fly? Oh, um, sorry. I didn't think anyone could hear me. I'm trying to get a good photo of the bird in that tree. How come? Um, well, there's a study group from a fancy prep school in the park today. I hope if I share my bird studies with them, they'll let me join them. But I don't have any good pictures, and the bird I'm watching hasn't moved in hours. Hmm, maybe if you throw something up there, it'll get spooked and fly off? Oh, no, 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 I wouldn't want to risk hurting it. But I guess if somebody climbed up there to scare it off, that would be okay. Okay, can we? We still haven't been able to find the monkey again. To get another stamina upgrade? Yeah, it's been a while since we've seen him. I hit it. Oh no. I was trying to just scare it. <laughs> oh no. Okay, yeah, I can't get up there without a without a monkey upgrade. I find another monkey. Hey again, alligator. Have you decided to rally with the Paragons? Sure, yeah. I'm uh, thinking about it. I wanted to see what kind of project you were doing. Excellent. I'd be happy to introduce you to the thrilling world of rock engineering. Rock engineering is all about building tools and systems for a safe and efficient excavation. Uh-huh. To do that, it's important to understand how strength, size, and temperature affect rock fracturing during mining. Uh-huh. A single calculated error could cause a massive landslide or cave-in and devastate the lives of... Wait a sec. Mining, rocks, tools, strength? You're just like a blacksmith. It's exactly like a blacksmith. Or anything else that keeps you excited... <laughs> it keeps you this excited about it. That's great. My friends and I are building a fantasy town in the playground. You should come be our blacksmith. It's unmissable as a community service. I'd be honored. Unfortunately, I'm still in the middle of my study. You wouldn't believe how hard it is to dig up a paleolithic artifact around here. I can find you an artifact for... I cannot find an artifact for you. That's just the kind of thing heroes do. Is that so? Hmm. In that case, I have devised a brilliant plan. Oh, noble hero, heed the plea of this android metal rite, and seek an enchanted mineral on a faraway coastline. You need a rock from the beach? Yep, pretty much at any beach rock, as long as it's overflowing magical power. Bring a nice sparkly beach rock back here, and together we will forge something that'll blow you away. Can do. I appreciate Suzanne's enthusiasm. Yeah. Wait, why am I climbing? What am I climbing? Oh. <laughs> Hi, Anton. Hey. So you're like the beetle guy. Just a normal guy for now. Still waiting on the tragic surgical mishap that will transform me into the beetle guy. Huh? Never mind. Did you need something? Yeah, I'm getting people together for a game, and there's a legend of a hero character you'd be perfect for. A beetle-related character, I assume. Yeah, they love beetles, and they talk funny and sell rare, sell you rare stuff. It'll be fun. I'll pass. Oh. I've got my own rare beetles to find. Oh, that's okay. Do you want help with that instead? Really? Yeah. I'm the best at helping. 
Come on, that beetle so fast, you'll be done in no time. I'm in no rush. But another pair of eyes couldn't hurt. Take a look at this. Oh, that one. I've seen that one in science books. It's a Hercules beetle. They're native to this forest, but not common. Are they really that big? Only if they eat their vegetables. They're slow and clumsy compared to other beetles, so about as fast as us. You'd have to surprise them. Gotcha. They eat rotting wood and fruit. I usually look around the fallen trees. Gotcha, gotcha. Also, listen for a sandpaper sound they make. They stridle their abdomen against their... Elytra to... Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I have all the beetle knowledge in my brain. I'm a beetle finding machine. No more beetle facts required. Right. Well, take this in case you see one. I got the bug net. Perfect for capturing e giant evil beetles. Good or evil, I'll take whatever you can find. Wait. Wait. That's a... Oh my god. Wait. I have questions. I am bothered by the fact that there is an iguana next to an iguana. This iguana has an iguana. What? <laughs> is that his younger brother? I... Help. I am... I am deeply bothered by this. It's like the cats running around in Night in the Woods. I was also deeply bothered by the cats running around in Night in the Woods. Yeah, the birds in Animal Crossing also. My word, if it isn't the great hero who seeks to unite us all at the heart of the world. Wow, you really know about the game? A good marketer must always keep their nose in the latest news. I adore the idea. I've already devised a quest for you. Awesome. Better yet, I've incorporated elements of my research project. Aw, oh, man. Around here, paper currency is scarce, but our hearts and lunchboxes are brimming with life. The coordinations, uh, the conditions are perfect to experience real-life bartering. A cupcake for a keychain, three juice boxes to build a fence, that sort of thing. I have paper currency, sort of. It's paper. Unfortunately, I lack even half of your creativity with raw confetti, so it holds no value to me. However, I do have a heroic service I need to be performed. Maybe you'll be up for it? Well, I guess if it's a heroic service. Upon that hill nearby is the land where the leaves never change. There is a horde of shape-shifting monsters. Shape monsters? You mean shapeshifters? You might catch them doing a pinch of shifting, but mostly they just shape. Whatever they are, they have a small chance to drop a special yellow triangle. <gasps> Heroes are all about getting yellow triangles. I knew you'd appreciate that part. Once you have the yellow triangle, I'll trade you anything in my shop for it. Cool, what's in the shop? Right, of course. Let us let me get it all laid out for you. Here it is, a fine selection, I dare say. Have a look around if you'd like. Otherwise, I wish you safe passage in the hills. But, okay, I wanted to look at what you have. Oh, okay. That a pile of soggy gum wrappers? Silvered spitballs, perfect for dazzling delinquents or bullying magical monsters. They're pre-chewed, pre-spat, and packed it with gum for an extra wallop. Gross, no thanks. Not your taste? How about this? A sprig of magical springtime grass. The greenest, most vibrant grass you'll ever see. Uh, it was much greener when I gathered it back in spring, of course. What about this one? You have a keen eye for finery. That is the, my only product that isn't made of garbage. Can you believe my mother was throwing it away? We want ser a serving dish, but I can only dream up of how a clever hero might put it to use. It's pretty. I think I'll pick this one. Splendid. I look forward to a lucrative trade. You are but a triangle away. Perfect. Oh, Ooh. they're the Triforce, yeah. Oh, that, that's cute. These are definitely shape monsters. They're definitely shapes. They're the most shaped. Wait, oh, I'm using the bug net, okay. I was like, did I get a ladle? Playing WoW again. 
half a cheese sandwich. Finally, I have cleared out the whole forest for this yellow triangle. Not the kind I was expecting, but it must be what Gene wanted. Time to go trade up. <laughs> one of the monsters stole Gene's lunch. Last one does the dishes. Last one needs socks for breakfast. Where are your parents, Locator? Back, Gene. Is this the yellow triangle you wanted? I had to fight my way through the entire forest, but I got it. Oh, yes, it is. But, uh, well, about that. Hi, alligator. Check out this cool stuff I just bought. It was going to cost me a bushel of apples, but I didn't know what a bushel is, so I haggled it down to two apples. What? Gene! It's, um, well, you were taking a while to find my lost lunch, and I was getting very hungry. So I got a bit desperate. Oops. You can't just sell the whole shop while I'm doing you a heroic service. No, of course not. Bad, very bad form. Oh, this is quite the pickle. Wait, alligator, did you want to buy some of this stuff? I was supposed to get one of the... One as a quest reward, but okay, let's haggle for it. Haggle? Uh, well, let's see. Um, Esme will want the grass for rituals. The shiny beads are perfect for Andromeda. I was gonna use the weird frisbee as a serving platter, but I can part with it. Uh, what do you want for it? Well, I've been looking for something to be the signature dish or the focal point of my restaurant idea. Something that sits neatly on a plate, but. Uh, but upright enough to be seen from an, uh, an audience angle. Something brightly colored to contrast the dark cutthroat world of competi uh, competition cooking. Something that projects both opulence and scarcity. Something like, I don't know, half a cheese sandwich? But who only finishes half a sandwich, uh, half of such delicacy? Seriously. Yeah. I have that. You do? Yep. Let's trade. Amazing! I love this fucking game. This is a wonderful game. Finally, I got the really this really big looking plate. Man, bartering is easy. So you won't have a fancy plate for your sandwich on. Put your sandwich on. What do you mean? Oh dang, you're right. That's okay. With my buttering skills, pretty sure soon I'll be rolling in plates. Uh, you'll have your own plate mobile. Away I go in my amazing patent pending patent pending plate mobile. Bye, alligator, bye! Well, that was fortuitous. You got off the hook easy. I hope you learn not to make a promise like that next time. Absolutely. From now on, I'm never doing business on an empty stomach. I guess this means the research project is cancelled, huh? Heavens no. This kind of data is indispensable. What? To witness an exchange of goods completely outside my influence was inspiring. If I can convert the raw materials laying around into more goods, I can simulate even more such trades. Say, you're good at making things. How about a business partnership? Uh. Oh, I've got a plate. Ah, no. No, stop bouncing. Oh, no. I mean, bounce, but not that way. Wait, why are you over here? I guess, oh wow, the draw distance. <coughs> Got a beach rock. I mean, enchanted ore. Suzanne can smith this into something cool. Maybe it'll be a magical sword or an amulet. I can't wait to see. Can't wait for her to like wrap some wire around it. Oh. Hello. Hello? A Naruto group. Oh my god. Sam, it's you. <laughs> it's you, Sam. Did you know it's you wearing the headband? <laughs> not entertaining this bit. It's not a bit. 
you had a headband. You never get to live that down. Suffer. I am. What do you want? Oh, I was just gonna ask if you wanted to play. Sorry, sorry, I'm mad at someone else. We were supposed to do this thing together, but never mind. 